Lee, any, 25 years later, anything changed? I mean, is it any less special? No, it's still special after the very first time, you know, uh, the championship game. But just coming back, seeing all the fellas, it's, you know, family affair. Come back any time and every time. How has the championship impacted your lives and these other guys over the last 25 years? I mean, you have the only championship in Razorback history as far as basketball. Um, still the recognition you'll get no matter where you go. Uh, probably not as much as Coyle as Scotty, but uh, just amazing. The love that we receive, how everyone treats us, I mean, wouldn't change for anything. Hey, how you doing, man? Good one. 25 years later, his name's still not on that court. What is up with that? I have no idea, but I'm definitely behind it about getting it back on, getting it on the court. I'm all for it. I really believe that it should be for a man who's accomplished as much as he has here for the Razorbacks. It definitely should be on the court. Lee, a lot of people talk about that. You know, it doesn't affect recruiting long term. You know, when other schools go in and talk about that. You know, in your opinion, you know, does Mike go against you know even different odds with that name not being on the court? I don't know. And I don't think that he goes against different odds. Uh, it's just that the game has changed so much and um, just the way you recruit has changed. Like for me, you know, coming from Waco to have a team like Arkansas come and want me to come here, without a doubt I was coming. But these other schools, uh, I don't know if it's the one and done or whatever, kids not coming for the education. I don't know. You talk about the game has changed. What do you think is the biggest difference between 1994 when you were playing and, and today? I don't know if it's like the chemistry or whatever, like our guys, we were always together, not just on the court, but like off the court. We stuck together. I mean, whenever there was an issue, there was no egos. I don't really know much about this team, if there are any egos, but on our team, no egos. If Corliss had 15 of our outshine Corliss, we didn't care. It was all about the win, not about who had the best game. Well, just what's it been like this weekend, um, seeing everybody and being back together? Like I said, just a reunion, you know, coming back, spending time because we hadn't seen each other since I think like 2013 when I came back. Um, I spoke on that last night that we shouldn't just come back just because the university is hosting something for us, which we are truly appreciative of. But as close as we were, as close as we still are, we still should get together more often because you're not know, promised tomorrow, you know. Mm -hmm. You don't want to have to come back just because someone's passed away or anything like that. How nice is it, though, to pick right back up where you guys left off, even though you haven't seen each other in a long time? I mean, it's time. just like, you know, riding the bike. You know, you may not ride for a while, but once you get on, you know exactly what to do. So, things just, it's the chemistry.